What is up, Riser fam? It's me, Coach Steli, here with another quick tip for you guys in better understanding extension. Why is extension so important? It's because that's where we continue with our power and that's how we can maximize our power through the zone. A lot of the times I see players make contact and then once they've made contact, they think that that's the end of their swing. They think that they've finished everything. In reality, the more you can keep your barrel through the zone longer, the more power you'll be able to have up the middle. So with extension, a lot of the times, uh, players, like I said, they get to contact and they think the swing's over. So what happens? They finish, they let loose and their front shoulder opens and they just finish their swing. Almost like they're in a rush to finish their swing. And then what happens is the ball goes to third, they foul it off, or they just swing and miss because they're completely out of the zone. This zone that we have right where home plate is, we want to be able to make contact and then continue, continue, continue our barrel through the zone towards the pitcher or up the middle towards center field. That is when we're able to use all this power that we've generated in our back hip and we're able to use it at contact and then explode, explode, explode until we can't explode anymore which is our extension, and then you can finish your swing. What happens after extension is up to you. you can, every end of the swing is different. You can either finish with one hand, you can finish with two hands. The important thing is that you don't finish our swing at contact. We try to keep our barrel through the zone as long as possible. Some exercises I like to do about for extension is finishing my swing and holding it at extension. So not worrying about the end of my swing. A lot of the times I like to just focus on being powerful to contact and then extending and, and holding this position where my barrel is facing the pitcher. That's really gonna work your core and allow you to understand how important the second half of contact is. A lot of the times I do this drill in our wide stance because I'm strictly focusing on, on extension. I don't, I'm not really focusing on my load. I'm not really focusing on my step. I really just wanna focus on being explosive with my upper half and my back hip, and then holding my finish towards the pitcher. So I'll get into a wide stance. And then from here, it's quick to contact. And then my focus is keeping my barrel through the zone and holding my barrel towards the pitcher. This is how I wanna finish my swing. I don't want to finish out here. I want to finish towards the pitcher. Like that. So I, I try to hold my swing and really engage my core so I can feel this movement towards the pitcher. like that. So I hold it and I really hold it for like two to three seconds so that I feel my core engaged and that I feel my whole barrel going through extension, through contact and then continuing through extension. So my focus is on the barrel going through the zone and I'm not worried about the begin, the end of my swing and I'm not worried about what I do in the beginning of my swing with my stride and with my stance. That is just one exercise that I like to do. There's so many different exercises you can do with extension. You can work with a small bat and you can work on top hand and bottom hand. The small bat helps a lot with just being able to control it. It's lightweight and you can focus on one hand at a time. That's really breaking down extension and really breaking down the upper half, but this is a great tool to use. Like I said, extension is very, very important in a swing. I believe it's what's gonna take your swing from average to elite, is when you're able to continuously put your barrel through extension every single time, and that's when you're gonna find out that that's how you maximize all your power and you're able to be consistent working up the middle. This is just a quick tip for you guys to really better understand extension and why we do it. There are so many videos on the Riser app that will show you exercises to do with extension. It will talk about drills to do and how to incorporate extension in your everyday hitting routine or everyday practice. That's all for me from Coach Steli. 
in continue using extension, continue grinding and coming onto riser and using these lessons to get better. Like I always say, we are getting 1% better, whether it's physically with our hitting or mentally with our mental training, we're always gonna be getting 1% better. And I'm so excited to be doing this with you guys. Can't wait to see you at, one, at more of my lessons. See you next time.